further into the video. I wanted to share the daily edit set from Necessaire because they just launched a new product, which you guys have heard me talk about, the body serum and the body lotion. I love these and I use them religiously. I always have like a backup under my bathroom sink for when I run out. I've probably gotten through like 50 of these body lotions. I like that they're fragrance free and they don't irritate my skin at all. But they just came out with their sunscreen. It's 100% mineral sunscreen. It's for your face and neck. It's SPF 30. It has hyaluronic acid and niacinamide on it, so it's like a skincare as well. And like, there are, I'm gonna show you guys how I apply it because I'm about to go outside again. And I kind of sweat. I did it this morning before I did my workout outside. And I include it in my skincare routine. But I need to reapply because I definitely sweat on my face before I go outside again. And this is really nice because I feel like a lot of sunscreens can be very clogging. I have very, oh, I did a little too much this time. I have very sensitive skin, and so my pores will get clogged very, very, very easily. And a lot of sunscreens are not, like, are a lot more greasy and can cause me to break out. But I've been doing this one for, like, two weeks and traveling with it. And it's worked really really well on my skin you can see that I'm pretty glowy just after putting that on I mean I'm not wearing any makeup at all and I'm still a sweaty mess from my workout this morning but they're selling these three products as a set it's called the daily edit on the website oops save $30 if you buy them as a set and then you can also get 10% off with Ella Rose 10 I'll put a code right here and link it all in the description but they're just a brand I come back to and back to and back to over again and I promise you guys will like their products if you try them. I've never met someone who didn't like them. It has been a minute. It is August 9th. I literally don't think I've vlogged since my Nantucket trip, which is for my birthday in June. I, as you can see, I just actually filmed. I didn't have time to film my hello to you guys before, but I just did a little workout with Kelly Cole. She is my girl. She is literally unbelievable. And she's like so pregnant and just like crushing life. And I hope I look like that when I'm pregnant one day got a good sweat in it's miserably hot here in new york like it's not enjoyable to be outside at all and it's not really enjoyable to be inside especially because my ac unit she's not working as hard as she used to and my one in my living room is covered by my desk so i've never ever been able to turn on like ac or heat in this one which i you know i took that loss when i put my desk over it it's hot in here it's very hot made myself some iced coffee. I basically just did my pour over and then put it in the fridge while I went to the workout. Haven't had coffee yet. Workout before coffee, that's impressive. I've been using this new milk. This is not an ad, but I just wanted to share because it's actually pretty cool. It's called Millie Milk. Basically, it comes freeze-dried. There's an almond and a coconut, but they have like more than those ingredients in it. And you put it in here, like it comes in like a packet and you pour all the freeze dried stuff into it and then fill it with water and then shake it up and it basically turns into the super creamy milk. This one's coconut and I really, really like the taste of it in my coffee and in like a granola bowl. It's just very creamy. I have a fun week ahead. The manager actually just flew into town and I'm gonna see her tomorrow. We have a full day of meetings tomorrow. Thursday we have a little dinner that I'm hosting with Tan Lux and Dolce Vita, which will be cute and I'm excited to bring you guys to. Today we're just working. I just got back from Miami yesterday. I have an order to fill for Skin by Ella on Free People, so I'm going to try and work on that for the next hour or so. You can see it's all right here. And then I might try and meet up with my sister, Lucy. A little bit later and maybe just catch up and shoot i just got my order sent out for free people and then these flowers just got delivered with like a hand invite for the event on thursday with dolce vita and tan lux 
So those are really cute. I just put them in that vase. Do you guys say vase or vase? I used to always say vase and then when I worked at Gucci, my boss would always call it a vase and we always sent like flower arrangements to clients. And so then I started calling it a vase because I feel like it made me sound smarter. <laughs> I mean, it makes you sound like European or something. It probably sounds dumb saying that. But anyways, I'm going to run a couple errands. I need to get two things fixed at the tailor. Not fixed. One, I need to get hemmed. And then I broke like a strap off one of my dresses before I even wore it. So I need to get that done. It's so hot here. <laughs> I don't even want to leave my apartment. And I know this is crazy, but I'm going to go sauna after I run some errands because I've been really anxious. And... The sauna honestly like helps me so much clear my mind like I put my phone away I lay in there I get a good sweat on I get rid of toxins especially after like traveling like yesterday's flight was not fun and it just makes me feel better especially in the evening and then come home have a very chill night and cook this room it's become my favorite it's 95 degrees out and I'm choosing to do a sauna I think I'm a psychopath okay I'm 33 minutes to go 32 so I'm 28 minutes in it's at 157 it's very hot but it feels so good I'm gonna try and make it to 60 usually I open up the door and give myself a little break around 20 more minutes but Let's see where we end up today. I'm obviously very safe about it. Um, if I ever feel lightheaded or like my heart's racing, I get out and I sit on the floor and I end early. I do know some people like faint in here. Thankfully, I've never fainted in my life. But I drink two, hold on, I'm naked, of these while I'm in here. Two full ones. And I'm already on to ugh, the second one. It's getting foggy because it's so hot in here. Okay, this might be kind of gross, but... I ended up getting out for five minutes at the 10 minute mark because it was really hot and it's probably because I was actually taking a phone call in there in the beginning so I was talking. So that definitely probably made it more difficult because you're like breathing heavier and like talking. And then I got back in for the last five and whenever I finish my heart rate is like pretty high. I'm really really hot. Also it's like 95 degrees here outside. So that makes it even more difficult but I always sit lay put the towel down and lay on the floor for like 10 to 15 minutes before i put my clothes on because there's no showers here so i literally take the subway back in my sweaty ass self and put it in my clothes and then get home and shower oh and if you want to book you can use code l and you can book any of their services i've also done that they're like iv drip and they have other locations they just opened a no home one but i don't think that one has the saunas So, I've washed off all the sweat, but I'm also currently sweating again, doing some work on my computer. I really need to go get a pedicure if I have time because I just looked at my toes and they are disgusting. And I bought these from Trader Joe's yesterday, so I'm going to be snacking on them. I'm also going to make like a big dinner tonight because, but I need to wait because it's only 5 and I need to have it ready at 7.30. Mm. Yum. I love cherries. They're my favorite fruit. Okay, I'm going to go to the nail salon in a second and just get a pedicure, but I prepped some chicken breasts for this evening. I just bought chicken breasts at Trader Joe's, and then I keep seeing on TikTok how to butterfly it. I didn't know it was called that, so I did that. Then I made my own marinade. I did... I really like this Brightland olive oil because it has lemon in it. And then I did half a lemon juice, two garlic cloves, honey, Dijon mustard, some nutritional yeast, salt, and pepper. And I whisked it all up and then I poured it into this container. And I'm going to let this all sit in the fridge while I go to the nail salon. And then I'm either going to, I wanted to try baking it, but I might just saute it. So 
stay tuned. Walking to my fave nail salon. I did a TikTok on this, but the masseuse here is literally the best place in the or the best masseuse in all of New York, if not the world. I'm obsessed with him. His name is Peter. It's called Spa Day Reho Booth. Try it. Okay, these are my marinated chicken breasts going in the oven. I'm doing it for 25 minutes and then I'm gonna check because they might need a little do a free week there it's like a no commitment for a week and you can do it unlimited which is like the best deal ever so if you've never tried core power try sculpt you get a whole week for free okay i'm getting ready for a meeting i'm going to the vet in the west village i need to get ready really quickly putting on the sunscreen from necessary it's actually supposed to be like a little bit cooler today which i'm excited about because this weather here has been zero percent fun to be outside and i'm wearing boots and these are gonna be sweaty i'm already sweating in the boots and i'm not even outside yet on my neck too okay she's ready i think this is the first time i'm ready on this vlog let me show you guys my outfit free people romper and then these boots are from, oh my god, where are they from? By far. Very cute. They're a pair with this little brown bag. This is from, it's called Bob Ore. And I made some sunnies. I put some waves in my hair, which I don't really do, but it's kind of giving. You don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So, my first meeting was really good. It was with Veronica Beard. We went to Bouvet. My manager was there. She helped me shoot my Free People outfit after in the West Village. Bouvet was so good. I've never had it before. And obviously, you seen on Instagram, I got the like boiled eggs. No, they're not boiled steamed eggs it's like scrambled but they're really soft and they're really good now i'm walking to meet with free people my manager's meeting me there again we're going to il buco which i've also never been to so we're also getting some art foods in here as well it's yeah. like this here <laughs> so cute in here <laughs> Okay, so I made it home. I ended up going with the, let me find it. This really pretty print. I'm gonna wear it when I go to Ojai in a couple weeks and I'm planning on vlogging that too because I'm gonna be better. But I just quickly changed and touched up my makeup. I am running to American Bar to have one last meeting with another company and my manager and then I'm carrying this huge Steve Madden bag with me because I'm shooting something fun with Paige and it's gonna be hectic I'm sure fascinating look who it is wait I love the eye makeup we just shot an ad guys and like it's giving Halloween town <laughs> <laughs> is it October yet 
It kind of was giving Halloween. No, it's really cute. And I can't wait for you guys to see it. Wait, it, that is it actually turned out cute. I almost said a meltdown. No, Paige, but I'm also like, whatever, you know. Yeah. Ella's like, yeah, mm, this whole thing. And I'm just like, <gasps> <laughs> literally, I'm like having a meltdown out there on the street. Wait, also, wait, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, so my eye makeup's really dark because I'm going to like a nighttime thing. But I was shooting a daytime girly <laughs> ad. It wasn't too daytime or girly. This, I look like, you know that meme that's like when you have blue eyes and it's like, really scary. I think it looks good. I also literally love the hair. But yeah, thank you. You always like me more like a cheap I do. girly. I don't love the long like, hair. I know, you've always said Not that. on you, like just on anyone. No, I get like, that. Super long hair, it's not for me. I get it. I like go through phases. I think you look so much more mature. I do, it's more- You look like you're closing deals. It's more expensive, <laughs> especially with this blazer on. Shark Wait, tank. Yeah, <laughs> he's giving shark he's giving tank. Shark tank. <laughs> Morning peeps. I should have vlogged earlier, but I just worked at my computer. But I should have showed you that I made these amazing cauliflower things from Trader Joe's with avocado and tomato. It's on my Instagram. If you saw it, get the cauliflower thins. I'm about to walk to Soho. I have a private workout with um the Sculpt Society. It's at Energy, it's like a studio in Soho. And like the dance workout so it's really fun so i'm gonna walk there get some steps in do the workout and probably get a walking back maybe city bike although i'm kind of freaked out by city bikes at the moment also i know you guys are going to ask about these headphones and they're master and dynamic do you want to film clean before or do you want to do it after? yeah will you introduce yourself oh my god hi hi vlog I'm Katie. And we're going to be doing, we do this workout, we try and do, no you're not. We try and do it like once a week, but basically we're going to be doing a Sculpt Society workout. Look, I'm already sweating and that's just from walking here. Like, it's going to be great. I'll film some parts of it. <laughs> the event tonight I straightened my hair which I literally haven't done I feel like since I was in like high school I mean I'm sure I have but like I've never, I usually do like the blowout look and not the straight look and I wanted to do something different I'll show you guys my outfit this dress is by Nana's closet I'm wearing these Dolce Vita shoes with it it's kind of see-through so I just wore black underwear I'm excited. I'm a little nervous, but it should be, it should be a fun night. So I was like, I'm gonna make breakfast with what I have. I didn't have eggs, so it's like, doesn't feel very breakfasty. But I got figs for the first time because I kept seeing them on Instagram, and like I've never really tried a fig, and this one I accidentally got some kale on it. They're so good. I got them at Trader Joe's. Uh, really sweet. They're not like overly sweet. I really like them. And then I literally sauteed a whole pepper and. Kale as my breakfast. 
And yesterday I made those cauliflower thins with avocado, which felt like more breakfasty. I'm not a huge breakfast person. I like like definitely like lunch and dinner foods more because I think it's because I don't really like eggs. I like bacon a lot, but you know, more breakfast. Um, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Mm. I will make sure to leave everything for necessary down below. My code is Ella Rose 10 for a discount. Make sure to check out the daily edit set. It's literally my favorite. The sunscreen is very, very great. You guys need to try it out if you are looking for like a sunscreen that doesn't clog your pores. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.